Hi, I'm Kara Greenwald, Senior VA Loan Specialist and owner of Creekside Mortgage. So I want to take a moment to go over why not purchase a large item while you're in the middle of a transaction. So over the years, I've had this happen to me a couple times. You always will hear a loan officer typically in the very beginning to say, you know, don't buy anything major, try not to buy anything while you're going through the process I'm getting approved for a home. I want to try to answer why, why they're telling you that. So when you go through and you do a loan application, you have a debt to income ratio where they take your entire amount of, of income you have receiving and divide it by the amount of debt, including your house payment, to come up with how much you can afford toward towards a payment. So if you go through the process in that 45 or 30 days you're going through a loan application, you are to go out and buy a new car, buy appliances, buy anything that's going to change that ratio, it's going to throw up a red flag to the bank and they're going to have to reevaluate based on what that debt to make sure you're still in a position eligible to go through and afford buying a home. Now when you're doing a car loan or you're doing an appliances or anything else, it's pretty relatively easy to borrow that money or to get that type of a loan. If you weren't to make a car payment, they could come out and take your car immediately from you. Um, it doesn't work that way when you're doing a house. Um, so when you're purchasing something like that, there's a lot of extra scrutiny that goes through and happens. Um, most places will typically pull a, final, pull a final credit report at the end of the transaction to verify that you have not purchased anything or nothing's gone through and has happened. So we we highly advise you to obviously, for obvious reasons, not to purchase anything while you're going through a transaction. Um, you just never want to have anything that's going to change those ratios or affect your approval overall in the end. So I hope you understood kind of what I'm going through and talking about there, but always feel free to call anyone from my office at any time um, to explain this further or to answer any other questions you might have. Thank you.